The Bank of Japan remains the exception to the rule. On Friday, it confirmed it was sticking to ultra-low rates. That's in contrast to other big central banks, which have been raising rates, and despite signs of rising inflation. New Governor Kazuo Ueda said the outlook for price rises remained very unclear. We expect trend inflation to heighten as economic activity heightens and the labour market tightens. But there's very high uncertainty on next year's wage negotiations and the sustainability of wage growth. Ueda said he would patiently sustain stimulus measures to support a fragile economic recovery. The yen fell against the dollar after the news, with Japan now a major outlier compared to other big economies. A day earlier, the European Central Bank raised rates to a 22-year high. President Christine Lagarde said she had to act. Inflation has been coming down, but is projected to remain too high for too long. In the US this week, the Federal Reserve did leave rates on hold, snapping a run of 10 straight hikes. We've covered a lot of ground. But Chairman Jerome Powell indicated that further rate hikes were still likely amid the battle against inflation.